here we go. It's the hump day showdown. That's right, Wednesday nighter. Me and Jerry are fishing it again. We're gonna go out here and try our luck. Had a lot of rain coming through. In fact, it's still raining right now. It's overcast, there's storms in the area. So the fish, fish should be biting. We're gonna get wet, but that's okay. It'd be worth it if we catch a fish. So looking forward to it, it's gonna be fun. The good thing is, is it's not 110 degrees with the heat index, which is what they were predicting yesterday. We got temperatures in the, what we got, like 68 degrees? 68? Yeah, 68 degrees. It feels pretty nice out here. So even with the rain suit on, it's gonna be okay. Um, in fact, Jerry's got a, a sweater on, a sweatshirt on. Yeah. yeah, so the weatherman's been a little bit off. It's a tough business, man. I guess, uh, I don't know, it's hard to, hard to predict anything nowadays. It's just a volatile environment. So uh, we're about to pull up to the boat ramp. We will see you on the water. I'm gonna have a uh, chesty on today. Hopefully I'm gonna get some footage. I might have to take it on and off because of the rain, but we'll do what we can do. So here we go. Just grab it. I can't help it. I saw that fish come up. He was sitting right on top of the water. Camera buster. There we go. That ain't gonna help, folks, but it's a nice slot fish. Don't look 16, but he was. Little fish. 523. We're in good shape. I need to get that. I want to get that other over in the boat, and then we'll be we'll be really happy. They're not jumping in the boat at all. I'm not getting a bunch of bites. But. Got some bluegill popping on these mats over here. There he is. It might be. Yeah, it is. I think. I don't know. It's strong. I don't know. He might not be that big. It's strong. Get ready. It's close. There we go, folks. I don't know. It's going to be a little bit short, I think, but it's still a nice fish. That was fun. Strong. Heck yeah, that was a really strong fish. Now, 17 and a half. Going back in the drink. It could be a big one sitting back in here. For sure. And yeah, then bluegill are chomping. Oh, it came off. Son of a gun. I knew that was gonna happen. <sighs> God dang it. Yeah, that was a good one, Jerry. I just couldn't do anything with him. My line, my rod is too soft. Got some good stain back here. Back to these pockets. There's a bass right there. See a bass back there. Man, that was stupid. I should've, should've just went to that fish with the trolling motor. I just didn't have enough rod to pull him out of the grass because it's a medium heavy. Actually, bigger than what I thought. 
Wake him up, Cypress Hill. Wake him up. It's <laughs> spraying, 17 and a half. Oh, nice fish. It's sticking the backs of these little cuts like this. There's one on the other side of that boat that's got a little run in in it that can get stained back there pretty easy. That's where I was going to go at first, and something just told me to stop right there. I just had a gut feeling. No, it's it's stained right here. There's a little run in that happens right here sometimes. Discovered it this winter actually. Caught a real good fish in here on the spinnerbait. This is a good spot for a big fish. It's got rock in the back. <laughs> that wouldn't help. Oh, you got him. I thought he came off. Well, he threw my bait. Oh, okay. The frog was about wore out. Too. You want to go get it, or? Yeah. Yeah, this, this crap is bigger. Oh, man. That was a good one. Came off that. See that piece of wood right there that beaver just swam by? No, a little one, no. Man, they're hitting this thing, but they won't, I can't get them. There's another bite. Two bites in a row. shallow that's one we need isn't it yeah. little one but barely freaking hooked just barely hooked they're just swatting at it let's go it's dead in here right there jerry right, right just through just saw a big one roll up right on top of that grass i mean i saw something roll up Good one. <laughs> 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 okay, my brother. <laughs> my brother. Hell yeah. Look at that guys. <laughs> that is disgustingly big. Big old freaking head on them. Okay, we're halfway there. Keep on throwing. I got this one. I ain't gonna put a coal on that one. Good one, Jerry. Is it good enough? It's close, isn't it? That's a fat fish, too. 
me see. Yes, it is. I got it. Man, I thought that was a big one. Almost 18, guys. Ain't gonna help though. Golly, it's a fat fish. Beautiful fish. I knew there'd be a fish there. I had a feeling there would be. Twice. I'm getting it good. I don't know, I'm getting the grass. No. It's a nice slot fish. Freaking thought he was big. that little under that little under was about 11 inches and we almost threw it back we ended up getting fifth place by just a few ounces so if we'd have thrown that fish back we would not have got a check so you always want to make sure that you've got your limit no matter how small because things can happen made that mistake last year we threw a small under and it cost us like third place so don't laugh at that fish we need a little water. I was letting that thing fall. Good one? Is, dude. I think he is. Come on, come on. It's close. right there jeez yeah, we were looking for one like you got Come on. you got a pretty good one yeah i got a 624 oh hell yeah 624 nothing to go with it no. nothing to go with it that's the problem with the four 17 and three quarters man. and 17 and like seven eighths and we caught that one and we still had an hour hour and a half to go and we were catching fish i was like we're gonna catch it we're gonna get another one 17 yeah, I know, man. Well, we caught those, that big one and then a nice under within like the first 20 minutes. <laughs> and we're like, we're sitting. You caught the big one right away? Yeah. I'm like, we're sitting perfect. Oh, yeah. You just need an 18 inch. Yeah. Big bass and fifth place. Huh? Big bass and fifth place. We did? Seriously? Place. Neighbors roll with 11 2 0. Left second place, 
Man, all right, we're driving home, and we had a better finish than what we anticipated. We thought it was going to take uh, like 12 pounds, just based on the conditions, but we ended up getting fifth place, which was a total surprise. So we got the fifth place check, and we got big bass, um, six, two, six two four. So that's a that's a really big fish this time of year over there for that lake. So it worked out pretty good, man. It worked out really good. We just could not get our other over. We caught several like 17 and a half 17 and three quarters so it's kind of frustrating um had the opportunity to do a lot better but you know we can't complain so um shout out to uh bobby and blake jackson for winning the tournament and everybody else that fished it was uh it was a good turnout a lot of fish were caught um we caught most of our fish on moving baits as you can see and we probably should have slowed down the last hour we've just been kind of milling things over on the ride home which is what we do all the time you know we talk about uh all the stuff we should have did and didn't do um but once again we got plagued by that second over not being able to have that but no complaints man fifth place and big bass is is pretty solid i mean we're very fortunate to get that um so hey we're going to be doing these wednesday nighters for the rest of the year and uh plan on releasing videos on them just so you guys can kind of follow along and see what that tournament trail is it's a usa bassin um short tournament five to nine fishing for two overs and two unders a lot of decision making man uh, it's it goes by really really quick if you get a bad rotation you're behind and it's hard to it's hard to figure out what's going on in four hours you know so it's uh it's, it's good for the mind it's good to keep you on your toes and keeps your uh keeps your decision making on par but that's it man it's a wrap man please subscribe to the channel if you have not hit that bell notification button so anytime i'm dropping content you'll be the first to know and, and share it guys please share it we're trying to grow this channel me and jerry i mean you see a lot of videos with jerry over there um he's just as big of a part of this channel as as, as me um and, and as well as any of the other like jonathan my buddy jonathan we got lots of people that we show on here but it's all it's all a big family we're trying to grow this so we really appreciate your support and that's all i got for you until next time